What is up everybody? RC here, also known as the RC Driver. If you are a driver or customer for DoorDash, Postmates, Amazon Flex, Grubhub, or any one of those apps that are delivery driver or rideshare related, you should be subscribed to this channel with the post notification bell turned on so you can be updated with the latest news and tips and tricks that are gonna be on this channel. I wanted to make a video to get a little something off my chest about the whole cherry picking thing. Um, if you want more information about this topic, I'll leave a link, leave a few links down in the description below to BZ and UDM's channel. I'll leave a link to their videos that they made uh, discussing about this. Um, from what I've heard, that Grubhub, if you constantly um, constantly reject orders they will put your account on hold meaning put you on pause and that's what um, that's what people are discussing uh, some people say oh you're gonna get deactivated you should not cherry pick at all or you should not excessive cherry pick you should a uh, cherry pick on occasion stuff like that I will admit I have cherry picked I don't, I don't, I don't like reject a whole ton of offers, but my whole solution to this is last time I checked, I thought we are independent contractors. We are our own boss. We are partnered with Grubhub. We're partnered with DoorDash, Amazon, etc. I thought we were partnered with them. We're not actually employees. So when that payout is displayed. This is our business. Keep that in mind. This is our business. We got to maintain our business. So when that payout is displayed, I'm going to choose the best payout rate that is best for my business. I'm going to agree. I'm going to make a deal to maintain my business, to help pay for my maintenance, to help pay for my gas, to help keep my business afloat. I don't know if that makes sense for any of you, but leave a like down below if you think, um, if you agree with me on that whole thing. But in conclusion to that, um, if Grubhub, I love Grubhub. Let me disclose that. I love Grubhub. I think they're a great company. They've helped me out so much. But if people are going to complain about the whole cherry picking thing then in the end why does Grubhub have a reject button anyway to reject offers so if we can't like if we can't ex it, it reject any offers then why do they even have it so there's going to be cherry pickers there's going to be people out there to Accept the offers that are help keeping their business afloat. I got to keep my business afloat. All of you have to as well. So I'm going to choose the best offer, the best deal, the best payout to help keep it up. Other than that, then what's the point of having the reject button anyway? Then, if they're, if we can't do that, make sense? I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments below of what you think and if you enjoy this video please leave a like down below and be sure to subscribe to this channel with the bell icon turned on and i'll see you all down the road see you next time